Robert Hess is the founder and CEO of the Prostate Cancer Awareness Project. He is also a cycling enthusiast who encourages other men with prostate cancer to battle the disease through fitness. So I created this little jersey and club, <laughs> so to, uh, you know, it's kind of a uh, goal, you know, for people, you know, and getting into uh, fit. Uh, the goal for his nonprofit is to lower the stigma and shame men associate with prostate cancer through fitness and a physical challenge to cycle 24,901.6 miles around the world. Uh, so once you ride 24,901.6 miles, .6 miles, which is a distance around the Earth wow. at the equator, then you can contact us and snag one of these jerseys. That might seem like a lot of work for a t-shirt, but fitness is a part of survival. Robert beat cancer. But it's not just his fitness that improved post-diagnosis. He says he changed his diet too. Without a doubt, um, um, I'm, I'm better off you know, having, having changed my diet. So what I did was change the diet, became kind of semi-vegetarian, you know, dropped, uh, you know, red meat, um, dropped all the dairy, and what that did is it dropped me about 10 pounds, it dropped down to about 150 pounds, uh, which was just a few pounds more than when I graduated from college and went into the Army. <laughs> Experts recommend a plant-based diet and cutting down on red meat, which the World Health Organization now classifies as a carcinogen. Robert hopes that his lifestyle change will inspire other cancer survivors to do the same. For Annenberg Media, I'm Paula Ilanze, Los Angeles.